Hi, this is Hal Donaldson of Convoy of Hope. And I'm sure you've seen the reports of the flooding in Louisiana. A state of emergency has been called. 25,000 people have been displaced from their homes. Another 10,000 are living in shelters. And 800,000 people have been affected by this flooding. The need is great. But because of the support of friends like you, Convoy of Hope has been there from the very beginning meeting needs, distributing food, water, and supplies, helping people get their lives back together. People have called and they've emailed us and they've asked, well, how can I help you right now in Louisiana? I know a lot of people want to go there and they want to volunteer, but here's the amazing thing. We have had so many people in Louisiana offering to help. An incredible army of volunteers is being amassed to help people put their lives back together. So how can you help? The thing that you can do the most right now is to make a donation to Convoy of Hope on our website. Just make that donation. Please know this, every dollar you give means more families receive help. So thank you in advance for caring. Thank you for giving. Please know that this is one of those disasters that it won't be over in a matter of days. It may be months before people are able to get back to work. The stores have been closed. Schools are underwater. Churches are underwater. They need our help now. So your gift, no matter how much it is, please know this, it will directly affect what we can do long term in Louisiana to help hurting people. Building something from scratch is tough. It takes effort, it takes resources, and it takes time. You wouldn't think of starting the process without some sort of design. And great design becomes iconic. The Golden Gate Bridge, the Eiffel Tower, the Roman Colosseum, a 1965 Ford Mustang. Great design endures, accomplishes its purpose, and becomes a beacon to all who see it. God's design for marriage has stood the test of time. His design is two strong, capable people collaborating, nurturing, and caring. Husbands loving and pursuing their wives and families the way Jesus loves his church. Wives empowering their husbands, helping them to be the very best versions of themselves that they can be. God's design holds nothing back in a covenant that says, I am never leaving, and it's fueled by the example we see in Jesus. When we commit to God's design for marriage in our own lives, we can build marriages that stand the test of time.